right? So without further ado, people, cool kid. This is our video that we came up with Saturday, like last Saturday, with some of our, some of our uh, members and free teams came up with. It's a poem. You can play it now, Mr. Wilson. Yeah, I just want to make sure I share share computer sound. Okay, here we go. Free teams, changing lives, transforming lives. Trust. Honesty. Mindfulness. Kindness. Loyalty. Free teams. Changing lives. Transforming lives. All right. That's wow. it for us. That was cool. So, <laughs> nice. Um, I'm going to return it back over to you. Janae, do you want to speak first? Yeah. or? I'm going to speak first. I'm going to um, talk All right. About all right, so I'm, I'm a storyteller, so I'm going to tell it in a story. So we were coming up with an idea to present to um, free teams. And we didn't really, we didn't know. We wanted to do something really extravagant and something like, you know, different. But then we had to bring it back and realize that we're in like a pandemic. So let's think about something that we all can do that is doable. So then we thought about relationships. And being in a healthy one, how a lot of young teenagers put themselves in situations where their relationship can become abusive to themselves, to their partner, and physically, mentally, you know. So we started thinking of words to remember when involved in a relationship with a partner or your family or your friends and teachers. So my word was communication. And communi communicating was a big is a big thing when it comes to any kind of relationship between your boss, between your parents. It's it's a really big deal when it comes to um, relationships with anybody. And we were just trying to think of different ways and how everybody, we're, basically where everybody mine was. Mine was communication. Jared was kindness. Um, Fatima, not Fatima, um, Savannah was understanding. So we just thought about words that kind of described a healthy relationship and we wanted to share those words with you guys just in case anybody was, they felt like they were in a position where they weren't being heard, the, re the relationship they were in was a little toxic, no matter if it was with your siblings or your mom, just remember those words. And when the next time you talk to them, you have to like understand like, are you actually understanding me? Are you listening to me? Are you being loyal to me? That was the whole point of our mini poem that we created. Great, thank you. Oh, um, I'm going to talk after her. All so right. basically, um, we came up with this poem last Saturday, I believe. Um, like Janine said, <laughs> it, it took us a minute because we were trying to think out the box. We really wanted to do something like really positive so everyone could understand that. We need to understand like what Free Teens is talking about and what Free Teens is preaching to us. So it took us a long time, like an hour, honestly. And so we realized what was on our hoodies. We all had our hoodies on, and we remembered it says free teens changing lives, transforming lives, changing, changing minds, transforming lives. And then we came up with what is a relationship for us, what are the positive aspects that goes into a relationship, like Janae had said. And we turned that into just a simple poem that we presented to you guys in the video. It was great. Now, good job, Jared. Good job. Thanks.